We are learning more about the Spokane man accused of shooting his father in the head, then trying to cover up the crime. 35-year-old Matthew Bussart was arrested Thursday and charged with first-degree murder. A caregiver found Matthew's father, Robert Bussart, dead in his bathroom. Our Ariana Lake was in the courtroom today when Matthew faced a judge. He joins us now with some surprising details, too, about this case. Ariana? Well, authorities believe Matthew Bussard shot his father in the head and then tried to clean up the blood and even eliminate evidence. Detectives describe Matthew as paranoid with a history of drug use. It was just after 9 a.m. Thursday when Spokane County Sheriff's deputies responded to the 8600th block of North White House Drive just outside Spokane city limits. A caregiver had called 911 after she found Robert with a gunshot wound in his head. He was covered in blood in his bathroom. Detectives found a gun, casings, and a magazine in a plastic bag in that bathroom with reportedly no blood on them. They also reported finding what looked like a body bag and a shovel in the backyard of that home. Matthew admitted to police he tried to clean up the blood when he says he found his father dead, but he never called 911. Authorities have responded to the Boussard's home three times within the last three months in involving alleged drug activity and disputes between Matthew and his father. Court documents reveal that Robert had threatened to throw his son out of the house for drug use. Matthew's bond was set at $1 million today. Live in studio, Ariana Lake, KXOY 4 News. Thank you, Ariana.